What's up guys, welcome back. I'm Elliot Delp and today I'm going to be doing a review on my Chinese SKS. So, let's talk a little bit about it. Um, this is chambered in 762 by 39 exactly like the AK-47. This is a fantastic rifle, okay? It's great for everything. Um, it was my first it was my very first hunting rifle. Um, when I was young and about, I don't know, 12 or 13, I had it with me on youth day which when I killed my first deer. So it's, it means a lot to me. I love this gun. So let me tell you a little bit about it. Let's start from the back and work our way more towards the front. So in the back of the gun, there's a place that you can put your cleaning supplies or a battery. Well, actually, I think it's just clean supplies. There's no way you fit in a battery in there. We're getting a battery out. You might fit it in there. Um, as you work our way forward, there's the safety. This takes down the upper. You can pop it up and everything will come out of it. There's the bolt. To release it, you need a bullet in there and you just pull it back and it flies forward. Here is the magazine. Uh, not really a magazine. It just holds your ammo, and that's how you release it. You just pull this thing back. The thing holds 10 bullets, so that's pretty sweet. Um, let's see, what else is there to talk about it? Comes with some pretty nice sights. I really like them a lot. They're pretty, well, okay. They're nothing special. The sights are nothing special, but they work really, really well. Um, and then you also have something to hold your bayonet up here. I'm not sure if that'll hold a bipod or not. I'm sure something will go there. Yeah. And I'm not quite sure what this is underneath the barrel. Maybe it's part of what the bayonet flies up into. Let me know down below. I'm not quite sure. But, man, yeah, there we go. Now that I've went over the rifle in, I guess, as good as detail as you want, or I guess a good of detail as you can get. There's not really a lot to talk about the rifle, but let's shoot it. So, quick disclaimer, I don't have my shooting stuff with me, so it'll be off a toolbox today. And we will be shooting Wolf Military Classic 762 by 39 124 grain FMJs. The very inexpensive bullet, probably like five bucks a box, but the SK should be able to handle the cheap bullet beautifully AR-15s suck at handling cheap ammo okay I've shot very few that can shoot like wolf good 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 bleh. I've shot very few AR-15s that can shoot wolf good I've shot some that shoot better than others but overall no bueno um yeah so let's get into shooting wait let's not get into shooting first Please subscribe. It would mean a ton to me. I love doing these videos and I love giving them to you. And the more you subscribe, the more videos you can see and you can get and you can learn about all kinds of cool guns that I have and that my friends have and that everybody has. But um, that's the first thing. Second thing, I'm working on my shooting, okay? I get all kinds of comments saying, like, close your eyes when you shoot. Yes, I know I close my eyes when I shoot. And it's just a bad habit that I have and I'm trying to work through it. So be supportive, okay? But. That being said, please tell me what I do wrong because I want to become a better shooter. I want to make better videos. I want to just do this better because I love doing it. I've just shot randomly for like the last, I'm 21 years old. So as long as I can hold a gun, I've just randomly shot. Okay, it's been nothing crazy. So bear with me. I'm working through it. I'm trying, like I'm mentally thinking about it when I'm shooting. So that being said, let's get into shooting. I'm going to shoot a group of three, by the way, at 100 yards. Alright guys, so here we are, a hundred yards, there's my target, that's a green thing with a little pink dot in it, with iron sights, so bear with me, but hopefully I'll do a pretty good job, we'll see, I'm not going to say I'm going to do a good job, but I'm going to say I want to do a good job. There's a group of three. See how that did. Well, guys, there's my group. As you can see, 
not the first gun I've been shooting today. But there's my group for the SK, and I'm pretty pleased with it. Definitely one and a half inches at 100 yards, so I would say that's completely acceptable. I was aiming at the pink. Obviously cannot see the pink, so that's what we got. All right, guys, so that pretty much sums it up for the SKS. Um, I thought it did pretty good. That's being about what I expected. I mean, I couldn't even see the pink dot. So, honestly, I was just pointing at the middle and shooting. But, because of that, that being said, I felt like the group was pretty good to be consistent. Um, let me know what you think, because this is like one of my favorite guns, if not my favorite gun. If I had to pick any gun to have out of the Grendel, the 6.5, 5.56, 308, you name it, it's this one. Um, yeah, I'd take it to Mars with me if I ever went, but that's about all I got for the video, so comment, subscribe, let me know what you think, let me know if you ever shot the gun and your experiences with the gun, I'd love to hear about it, go leave me a comment, anyway, thanks for watching, and remember, take someone outdoors.